Among other things, government has said time and again its commitment to implement the patronage of made in Ghana goods. One of such commitments is about taking shape in Kwabri East municipality as efforts to promote the work of local artisans to produce kente that would meet the taste and standard of the international community. Ose Asibe Bonsu is the municipal chief executive. In every year to bring all Kwabri people together, that to promote our craft. When we come to Kwabri, we are the original owners of Kinte Edinkra and this uh, carbon that you are talking about. So it belongs to us and we want to showcase it once in a year and that will bring all Kwabri people together to promote that uh, tourism industry, that to, to create jobs for our uh, youth. Now the, the, the tent is fading out, it's going out. So it's our, our plan to attract the youth to also involve themselves in this industry that you are talking about. So the purpose of the, the festival is to, the Union Festival, is to bring all our people together to, to promote our tourism industry, to promote our crafts and to create jobs for our people. But there is one challenge, lack of knowledge of the law that protects the product is negatively affecting the business our intellectual property law as of now when it comes to kente when you write a book if you're an author and you write a book you have that law protecting you that's copyright unfortunately for us we don't have that in ghana so if you are a kente weaver or let's say you are a wood carver and you come out with a new product which is very uh, unique in the market there should be a law which is protecting your product in as much as it is protecting your product you're also gaining something from that unfortunately we don't have that and we have to start from somewhere and i'll take this opportunity that as quabri citizens i'll be counting on the wood carvers association the kente weavers association as well as the kente sellers association and all other associations for us to join hands together and then push the government to come out with an initiative which will protect this copyright. Mahmoud Mohamed Nuruddin reporting.